On uh, September 12, 1952, in uh, Flatwoods, Virginia, West Virginia, West Virginia? Uh, there were many people that saw this kind of creatures in the area. In uh, January 2004, a policeman in Monterrey, Mexico, where Santiago lives, reported a creature like this attacking him in his patrol car. He fainted. This, is, this was a, an incident that caused a complete police mobilization because the police officer that was on duty at uh, 3 o'clock in the morning confronted a strange unknown being uh, that he described as a, as a flying witch, according to his testimony, because that was the in interpretation that he, he just uh, imagined uh, come to his mind. But this uh, strange entity that, according to his testimony, was flying, was uh, floating above, above the ground, suddenly uh, came to him, trying to grab him and to attack me. That was a, a very bizarre incident that, uh, in some way, uh, awakened or other kind of uh, sightings, fortunately, uh, that did not involve any attack at all, but uh, uh, that make, made us to stay alert because we were expecting some more sightings or some more incidents like this one to repeat again. Can we believe there are flying creatures, flying humanoids? They have been reported around the world. There are not images. We, we started through this web of uh, sky watchers, we started seeing them since 2000. This was the first video we got. Then just a month later, in March 2000, we had a second video from these kind of creatures. At, that, at this point, we, we realized that uh, this kind of rare, very rare sightings were repeating and increasing, and then Gerardo Valenzuela videotaped this strange humanoid entity coming almost to a land in Cuernavaca. For the first time, we can see them coming to Earth. And remember, these uh, videos were taped by our respected and, and uh, famous uh, sky watchers, so we don't have any reason to doubt about them. And as a matter of fact, they are the first uh, surprise with this strange and rare But sightings. then, 2005, and then we have now probably one of the most spectacular videos recorded on June 17, 2005. We can clearly see now a humanoid fi figure there with a strange object that is allowing her to fly. If you remember, what we just saw is very similar to that. It's probably what the policeman saw when he was attacking Monterey. We can clearly see this instrument, this object that is probably used to fly. This is a uh, fantastic video taken by Horacio Roquet at 7 o'clock in the morning in, over Mexico City. He was uh, going to his, to, his, to his war when he confronted this strange humanoid being just above the roof of the building in front of his home. And uh, he ran away and uh, took his video camera and began taping perhaps the most uh, explicit, the most impressive video of, a, of the flying humanoid ever, as you can see. Then I learned that months before he had recorded this, as you can see, on the 21, 21st of January or February 2005, he recorded this figure flying very, very fast through the sky, and it's very stable, proving that this cannot be anything explainable. At this time, we realized that uh, these sightings were, were going to come more and more, and uh, we were wondering from where. This is from uh, Rich Giordano, 
videotape. Uh, Rich is a good friend of mine. He, he sent me this video, very excited, and said, listen, I just got on tape one of those flying, little flying men that you are filming in Mexico, and I was very surprised. It's like it has something in the back. 